Matthew 25, he talks about, uh, so long as he did it to one of the least of my brothers and sisters, he did it to me. So our baptismal call is to the least of our brothers and sisters to make a difference in their lives and to treat them with the utmost dignity. So I started as her attorney, and as um, Patty said, uh, I've become more of a friend. Um, however, we're very excited. I hope you're excited, Patty. We're excited that I'm about to become her legal guardian. Jerry Glenn is um, a nice guy. Every month or six weeks or so, we go out to dinner. And sometimes I have to bring the bigger car because Patty has so many friends that want to join us for dinner that sometimes my regular car doesn't fit all of her friends. She really loves getting off campus and going to work. Um, when I first started working there at TJ Matt, they told me to start doing the shoes, like put the numbers on the shoes, and I put the number on the shoes. And they, they let me do something new at my job. They let me take the little pins off the hangers, like the numbers, and, and before I leave, they gave me a check, so. You like getting a check from working, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> You know, thank God for everyone who supports Bishop Grady. I, you know, shudder to think where Patty would be without Bishop Grady. During Lent 2015, Annunciation Catholic Church chose Bishop Grady Villas as our Lenten outreach partner. We were very impressed with the wonderful work that is done at the residential facility in St. Cloud. Through the efforts of our Ash Wednesday collection, we were able to raise $27,000 in order to fund the position of a work resource person to be here in Seminole County and North Orlando. And so in each human person, we're able to see the beauty of God's creation. What we're covering in adult day training is anything from social skills, interviewing skills, social etiquette, job skills. We're learning um, how to be uh, independent and we're learning math skills and time management time management. Owen will be the guy who stands out since we've been dealing with social skills. Owen greets people when they come in in the morning. I just love meeting new people. I've been meeting, I've been meeting yes. people each and every day. Yes, like we do. Every time I, every time I make a step. Steven steps up in class and we've covered this, we've covered that. Sometimes we do uh, get down to business, then after we get down with our business and our uh, our training, sometimes we can have some little bit of fun. Brave means don't be happy, be scared, just do it. We boil the water and we, uh, get the vegetables and then we put them in the, in the pan. We got the hot and chili peppers for my garden. You don't see the good for a pizza, hamburgers, and some burrito tacos. I enjoy every day. Bishop Grady Villas, you know, since its inception here in 2004, has been what I consider one of St. Cloud's great neighborhoods. I think it's a great family atmosphere here, and to, to interact with all the residents here, and the officers, I think, take great pride and pleasure interacting and talking to them and learning about what they're doing and, and the fact that they're working in the community and um, contributing to our community. When you look at how they live their lives, it's truly an inspiration. Yeah, I wanted to be independent and live more on my own. I ended up doing Chick-fil-A this year. We want to honor God with everything we have and be stewards of uh, what's been entrusted to us. And Laura has been entrusted to us. And Laura is amazing. Okay, what's core for? Smile. That's one of them, that's Always good. Always be upbeat. Okay. Stay connected. There you go. And Eye contact. There you go. Good, Good job, for you, bro. girl. That's excellent. Nailed it. Nailed it. Cows even want high fives. <laughs> high fives. <laughs> it's very busy. They keep you going nonstop. It keeps you very occupied and you're never bored and you always find something there to do. You saw the innocence of God displayed at Bishop Grady Villas. I love the friendships that I've made and the people that I meet. It's really fun. 
when I see the residents of Bishop Grady Villas and when I see them serving Mass and involved in other functions, I realize, first of all, their joy and their, the simplicity of their lives and their desire to, in a sense, celebrate life. It's an opportunity, I suppose, to just realize that we're truly blessed as individuals and that's, that's how they impact me. It's ultimately all gospel work.